Yo, what is going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Alessia's Low. We are on episode 80. Can you believe you know what I'm actually going to do? Undo this top a slight bit. But we are on episode 80 of this Road to Glory series, which is absolutely fantastic. You think how much hours I've put into this game and how much I've actually been rewarded. Obviously yesterday, yes, most of that uh, stream was without sound. <laughs> Uh, which is my my bad, but um, our pack look towards the end, packing the likes of Harland and Bruno in the two player pack, then we got Pop in the next one. We managed to get an insane, um, what's it called? Uh, you know, let's take out Layman for this purpose. We managed to get an insane hero in Fran Francescoli, who is worth about three hundred and seventy five k absolutely superb today we are going to be playing more squad battles and getting tony duggan um further evolved for the new um uh, triple threat um attacker uh but it is now six o'clock so i do want to see if we've got any new content in store that can be done today let's start by opening our preview pack that's it Jonathan Vieira. Um, right. What I'm going to do... Right, that is nothing. Right, let's start with the objectives. Uh, but I have some exciting news, which we'll get around to in just a couple of minutes. Um, let's see what we've got. So that is done. I need to go and get the uh, Ledley King um, SBC again. Uh, Champions Boost. Oh, it's this again. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, I don't play Rivals enough for that. Actually. Wait, how long have I got? I've got a week to do it. Four days to play 15 games. That's actually insane. Uh, do we have any more? Wait, did I... Do we not have anything? Let me just check. Uh, I'm trying to load up my... There we go. Let me load up my stream um, and try and see, was there no content whatsoever? Oh, well, I mean, it was that, but... Okay, there was no content for objectives, which is strange. Um... I assume no evolutions because there was one yesterday here. Yeah, there's no more evolution. Uh, SBCs. Let's have a look see what SBCs there are. So we've got a Selma Backer, Road to the Knockouts. That's a pretty cool card. Uh, 77 times 3 upgrade. Right, let's get this. There's an 84 upgrade as well. Um, but we might as well get this. While we're here, because then I believe we've got like eight games of them, maybe nine. We've got seven games for them, so we'll need tomorrow's as well, hopefully. Uh, let's see what else there is. Um, you wait for marquee matchups which we've got six days to do. That's fine, because I don't have an... Ooh! Ooh! Hello. A Cuthbert rotor knockout. What do you need? An 84-rated team. Oh. I think, you know what? I, I think when I've got a few more players at my club, I'm going to do Cuthbert because I think that's a fantastic card and there's a chance that she does get upgraded anyway. I like the picture. The picture's sick. Ooh. I like that. Oh, she's Oh, she's got some fantastic... I'm going to put Haaland into it, but, and I'm going to explain why, because next month we are getting a free Haaland, aren't we? So, yeah, I just need to get some players in, in the club to 
complete that. How long have I got to do? Seven days remaining on her. Yeah, we'll get her done. No doubt about that. That cough bear looks incredible. Um, realistically, she could. But is she more like a defensive player or is she just like a box to box? She's a box to box, really. Actually, she's more attacking, to be fair, but she can play CDM. I think. I think that's a fantastic card. That's a fantastic card, that Cuthbert. Um, right. Yeah, I think that's I think that's a fantastic little SBC. That is. Um, yeah, I'm happy to put in. I didn't even notice. No vote. That does not look like Hermoso. Obviously, Diego Fallen. I know is. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, I want that Cuthbert card. I just don't have the players at the moment, but um, I need to start playing rivals at some point. But I'm going to be playing squad battles today. Try and get my coins up, start to get some players in, and go from there. Really, um, but yeah, I do want that cough. But however, right, this is what I want to show you. So, as you guys might know, I have this custom Alessio Russo card. It's a it's a normal card. 84 rated. Obviously, I put it as a cam because that's where I was playing her uh, for a lot of this game. However, obviously, since she got an evolution, she's actually eligible for two now. But I think I got a better one, even though it's less dribbling because on the new one, she can get have 89 dribbling. Um, it's better pace and it's not better shooting, actually. She goes to 89 on both of the new ones. However, I think she's better at like overall stats. Um, so, so much so, I'll actually show you. Uh, obviously, she's playing Cam right now just because I'm upgrading Duggan. But she goes to 89 pace, so that's plus 7. She only gets like a plus 3 on shooting, um, a plus 2 on dribbling, which she would get a plus 5 on a new one. However, with this evolution, she goes to high medium. Whereas on the other one, she stays a medium, medium. Yes, she does get technical on the new one. However, on this one, she got rapid, I believe. But actually, she might have had that already. I can't remember. However, like I was very happy. But today, I have a parcel. As you can tell, it's a bit bigger uh, than the last one. But I want to show you. Uh, this is I haven't opened this, like you can see, both ends. Yes, it's taped up, but that is just... Must have just been taped up anyway. Unless someone has opened it here, but I hope not. Uh, which end is it? But this is my brand new customised Alessia Russo card. So, we're both seeing this at the same time. Oh, it is a box in inside of a box. Ah, oh, please be right. Please be right. First thing I want to do is make sure that the stats are right. Okay, so on the other side of this, as you can see, it is a card. Let me just see the stats at the bottom, guys, before revealing. 89, 85, 70, 86, 39. It's good. Oh, you know what? I will give a shout out to these because I've had a few cards. I've had this. I got this last year. My custom Ian Rush. Uh, what well, I need to put this up somewhere, really, um, because it is just dusty. It's just on. I have a slope in my room because that's I'm above the stairs. So I got this like a year ago, and I decided, look, if I'm doing a series, I need to get custom cards. So I obviously have this one. I have the Darwin Nunes, and I have the. Alex Morgan, but obviously Darwin doesn't get used, Alex Morgan I sold. I do need custom ones down the line, but I just thought, right, I've got an evolution of this card. So this one I put on a Heroes card, because I, I love the design. So, obviously I had to upgrade. Let me just see, actually, from a distance. I like it. Right, so you, you see this card on the screen. 
I didn't go with the Evo. I, I don't even think on the website you can actually do an Evo um, design. I do. I do understand that, like but the triple threat one. It's a shame it's not a new design. It's like the original, like dark green one, which I do prefer than this one. But this card I think is better. But say hello to my brand new upgraded Alessia Russo card. Look at that. <laughs> How sick is that? How sick is that? It's a bit, why is it a bit more flimsy than my Rush one? But, obviously, this first one is a hero card. She's upgraded to a legend, because she is a club legend. The stats are right, don't worry. Obviously, England and Arsenal. Arsenal won 6-2 last night away to Leicester. Alessia Russo got a goal and six. However, she's not going to get an inform because if it is going to be any inform from the WSL, it is going to be Palova, who got one goal, two assists, I believe. But yeah, I was thinking that card. I wanted to find, like, I do love that picture on this one. I, and this will go, prob I think it's going to go on the wall behind me, I think, like below. I think it's just going to go about there, sort of thing, but on the wall. But this one. I wanted a better picture. Well, not a better picture. I think that's the best picture, but I didn't want the same picture. So I decided to scour the internet for one. And this one, obviously, is... It's pretty good. It's pretty good. I, th I think, I think I've, I've chosen well. I think it just it works well for the card. They've done well. I like it, I like it. Uh, you have to give me some ratings, I think. But, seeing as it is uh, Alessia's allure, we needed we needed that. I think that's going to go up on the wall somewhere, so you're probably not going to see this much again. Because um, I think I'm going to put it behind the TV. Well, not right behind it, but to the side of it. I just think that, I, I just think that looks pretty cool. That is. Oh, I'll give you a close-up. Look at that. It's proper like an icons card, isn't it? It's a good picture. It's a good picture. But anyway, that is my brand new uh, custom card. Store that just in the box for now. Put that way. But yeah, if you ever want custom cards, go to yourfootcard.com. Self-explanatory. You can put send any picture them. It doesn't need to be like a uh, a PNG where it is like a cutout. Uh, you can send any picture and they'll cut it out and they'll design it for you. Um, when I did the rush one, they did send me a. I want to have a look actually because obviously the card design has changed because obviously you've got the the nationality and the club and then you've got all the stats clearer here. But now obviously they're just along the bottom. I just want to see. Size wise, I think this pitch is bigger. It is bigger. Look, <laughs> I definitely prefer it. It's just clean, isn't it? The design at the back is better. Yeah, no. Yeah, it's, no, it's sick. It's sick. In fact, I might put them both down here for now, and then I'm going to put that roof so somewhere. But yeah, rate that, rate that. I think that's fantastic. Obviously, when she gets another upgrade down the line, then I'll probably get another one, and I'll show the development of her in my club. But yeah, that that is my um, great news. That is um, okay. Right, let's just get into some games. I think because uh, I want to play like five games. How many? How many do I need to evolve? Duggan. I just want to get it done. Two. Well, four, realistically. Um, and, but also, I want to carry on with the, 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 the triple threat ones. So it's literally just having just scoring separate games and then scoring with all three of them. I can't do all of them today uh, for them, but uh, it is what it is. Right, let's just get into it. But yes, at some point I need to just grind rivals. Ugh. 65, 75. Uh, 
Let's just go up in order, I think. Oh, Kirby and... Um, I just didn't realise Kirby has a new dynamic image, which is fantastic. Fantastic. Hello, okay. it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather music front on, but... as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart oh. Robson. And we've got a foot squad battles encounter oh, yeah, coming up I'm using, for you. Uh, it's Madison. Dinamo, and they take on the founders. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. I need to put some music on. And here's the first 11 for Dinamo. Okay. Well, it's not fashionable, but 4-4-2 can still be a good system, both with and without the ball. Key to the thing is, like, even though I did that objective with Madison, I don't rate him. Uh, I mean, I could go for uh, Francesco Lee. Uh, yeah, why not? Then we'll... Beckham's boring to bring on, though, isn't he? Yeah, I need to think about that. I'm going to keep on Madison, then. They need to be the main creators. Right, first game, as always, is going to be rusty. Room to roam for Even though I play it every day. Well, to I'm just tennis, shit at this game. So a personnel change then. Good looking cross. Half hearted nice clearance. Go, Fran. Go to the middle. Don't mind that. Fran Don't Kirby. mind that. Oh, she's oh, rapid. She rapid. That's like the foot. Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. Williams. I just realised I do have Mallard that I can sell to get Cuthbert. Go on, Tony. Go on, Tony. Go on, Tony! It's actually going to be interesting because I actually don't know how my team's going to set up. When I mean, Tony's going to be my strike off the bench. I want my bench to just be women as well, eventually. Or, like, top players, but... Well, that's Kane's boring. I, I never bring him on at all. Good looking sequence. Crossing into the middle. Well, far too much on that particular cross. And the cross is immediately dealt with. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Alessia Russo. And Founders pushing forward with options available. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Waghorn. Can she find the right pass? Ah. And let's give credit to the defending. Oh, good vision. Oh, oh yeah, that's yeah, a yeah, super yeah. piece of defending. Connor Gallagher. Now Martin Waghorn. Sounds <laughs> They couldn't quite muster a real threat. Great ball. And it might be. Oh, great it ball. Is. Great She's goal. Love that. Yeah, I might sell Mallard so and get Cuthbert actually here. thinking about really it because I would have thought way. I can no get away with quite game. a bit of low rated players if I'm putting in uh, Haaland. Russo. I'm half tempted to put in Salah, honestly. Ashley I don't Neville. care for like just gold players really anymore. Well. 
Okay. Who does he look like? He reminds me of someone, I just can't think who. But Enzo Francescoli! Francescoli. Francescoli. I want that cuff back. You know what? Beckham might actually. His time might be up. Stanway. Genuinely. Oh, Francescoli. Oh, save. And he's fired over the corner. The cr well, let me just reply to Brandon. That seems sexy. Yep, that Cuthbert card is bang. That is so good. It'd be interesting so to see how many people actually time. do That's it. What the have said. Scotland, but the thing is, that I have uh, Chelsea players. That, I have Frank Kirby, obviously. That Cuthbert so keeps laymen out of the team. Who struggled badly in that first half have work to do. And support available. Incisive pass. Ball. And that a piece ah, of okay. goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And taking care of the situation. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Williams. Oh, she's made a crucial tackle there. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Oh, oh, and a oh, that rattling the crossbar. Well, what a good shot that was. Hit with such power, but it just didn't come down in time. in the right place to intercept and she's gliding through chance maybe well that's a wild attempt even though the angle was a bit tricky well the cutback would have been the better option there I'm sure about that Georgia Stanway Madison trying to open up the defense. Oh, she scored nice. again! A brace for her today. They simply don't know how to stop her. Williams. Francesca Lee. Plays it back. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. Well, another corner following on from the last one. Oh, That's a line. <laughs> well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Oh my fucking god. 
Oh, cut. The Founders have the ball again. Francescoli. He cuts it back. Oh, a goal! She's gone and done it! She's gone and found the net! Waghorn. Danger here as he runs at them. Oh, great attacking play. He might be able to carve something out. Ten minutes to go. Could be a chance to break here. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Oh, well, hit on the volley. <laughs> terrific strike. Well, it's a very difficult technique, but I actually think he should be scoring there. So two substitutes to come on in one go. Nice weight on the pass. Can he put it away? And disappointingly, not even close to hitting the target there. Yeah, he was looking to open up his body, guide it into the corner, but he's got it all wrong. It's a poor attempt in the end. This looks more than decent. And there! <laughs> She's fucking good, right? I need to turn on some music in my ear because it's the vibes aren't here. I know obviously you guys can't hear, but I feel like I'm more vocal because I'm just, I'm just singing. Not a great pass. I want to know how, how good Duggan's going to feel. I've sp this is going to be like 100k, Tony Duggan, by the way, when she's done. Yeah. Who can they pick out? We're going in a breath. Happy to take on the shot. Oh, oh just get well. it out. Appear to be in two minds. Right, so no, no. Referee blows for full time, and it. Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things. Do I look like I've got good big, big, big muscles? <laughs> I need some food soon. I just get in and I literally just start shooting. I need to put on some food soon because I want to play COD after. I've I just, I've completed two objectives. What are those? Oh, they'll be daily, daily won't they? I just realised, like, I haven't these reset. No, no, it doesn't. Uh, right. How much is Mallard? Actually, how much is Cuthbert? She is 34k. Um, I think she's like 14k, isn't she? 3250. Uh, I have so many 85s. Wait, where is she? I didn't sell her, did I? Did I? Oh, yeah. Oh, she's 86, that's why. That's such a good dynamic image on Greenwood. I can't wait for my team to come together. Right, I want to see. Because I think that back is sick. But realistically, the one I want is Aaron Cuthbert. I'm putting 91 Haaland in there. <laughs> Uh, 
Right, I need 81s really onwards. I did see an 81 a second ago, but. Oh, that she was 81. I don't even know if this is a good idea, but. Oh, come on. Ref. Don't show me them if they've been bought. You know what, let me just put in some, let's put in midfielders. I just need to see what I'm dealing with. Because surely I can get away with 82s, right? How? <laughs> I might, I might need like a couple of 84s. Caitlin Ford probably is one of the cheapest. Uh, for an 81. For an 83. Okay. I mean, it's manageable. Well, the thing is, I can go with 81 rated. I know that. You're gonna be the lonely one. Oh. Do you believe in that type the love? Oh, now he's bought. Do you believe in love after love? I don't know. Oh, oh. So I'm gonna wait for you, but I can't do that. Oh, she sold. Nice. Time to move on. It's love to feel strong. Oh, really? Yeah, oh. Do you believe in life after love? There's something in time they say. Feel strong enough, no. Do you believe in love at the love? Right, I can actually do Cuthbert. Do you believe in love at the love? Goodbye, Holland. This card is sick, and hopefully it does get upgraded. I love that picture, by the way. She has Relentless, she has Traveller, she has Long Ball Pass, Ping Pass, Whipped Pass, Anticipate. This is an unbelievable card. Right, I need to buy a Catalyst. Uh, 
A catalyst is perfect for Cuthbert. I don't need her to up a shooting or whatever. I think we have Georgia Stan... Now, Georgia Stanway in her position is good. Bring on tune. And then for the wing. Oh, you know what? Let's put on a Jordan Heidman. Nice. I'm gonna get the Gina to go. The icon, oh, the icon kits are nice, but I'm not spending 80k on it. Fuck that. It's destination Merseyside today, where live at Anfield. Dip. Joining me, Guy Mowbray, for commentary will be Sue shape. Smith. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's the founders. Just and a they take on the Hurricanes. Cheers, Guy. Well, I'm sure oh, both managers will have stuff. given them the final instructions. Go out. Right, I need everyone on that A game. Hopefully, that'll be enough for a positive yeah, result. Out, I'm man. looking forward to this one. And this is how the Founders team looks today. They are lining up in a 4 3 oh, two system. Against and with this, it naturally creates triangles all over the pitch. So it means lots of options for players. I just realised we're getting like a couple of packs after this. I don't well. know. Here's how the Hurricanes line up today. Allison is in goal. Mohamed Salah plays with Marcus Rashford out wide. And tasked with leading the line is Son Hyung Min. Duggan scores those. Duggan scores those every day. Right, I'm going to bring on... You know what? No, I'm bringing on Toon. Oh, no. No, hang on, no. That's, that's the way and forward that is. to wait long for the opening goal. It's 1-0. So it's 1-0 as the game restarts. Third goal. Ever closer to goal here. And she's being urged to shoot. Looking to put the cross in. A different angle of attack. Oh, I've got an itchy head. Oh, why is my head so itchy? Good work to regain possession. Where's it cheap? Feel my temperature rising. Aye, aye. Why is my head it cheap? Go, go. You're gonna set me on fire. When it's flaming, I don't know which way to go. Why is my head it cheap? Hey. Corner now, then. And a good chance to go further ahead. Eesh. And it's not the best of clearances. Having a look. Now hmm. to go a long way with this. Stanway. Oh, what is that pass? Salah. Showing I'm good burning, width with this attack. Burning. Nothing can cool me. My head is itchy. 
Why is it itchy? Because that shouldn't, like, piercing pains. It's not really itchy, then, is it? Well, she's got two now, and she's it's playing there, a starring though. role here. I don't know what it is. So it's 2 0. I love how this is Duggan's card without it being upgraded at least even once. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. My, I don't know why I keep getting. Ow! I keep getting the pain. Rashford. Odegaard. And the referee oh. has given a penalty. This to make it interesting. And he does the job from the spot. So off we Is go this really bugging there. me right now? Jordan Witema. Trying to carve out the angle. Oh, great block. Burn in love. Just a hug, a hug, a burn in love. Son. On to Erdegaard. And this could be. And that's a decent save, at least certainly made to look that way. Need to get tighter here. Ah. Uh, the approach play looked encouraging, but good uh, defending to snuff out any threat. Just now to deliver the ball. It this thing. Picked out nicely. God love. It might still oh happen. my! What, what a block! Right, two one at half time. No fear, go low. This way. So God love. In front. Plenty of football to be played in this game yet. Crazy little thing, go low. Oh, my baby. Robertson. She at a rock and roll. She drives here. me crazy. The ball is lost, and the chance has gone too. Well, she's produced a right, masterful come on, Fran. performance up to this point. Ten out of Sonny ten. Robertson. Sonny Robertson. No need to be afraid. Oh, they looked in be there. more afraid of Virgil. That's not real opportunity. And there's another one. That's fine. Virgil's a big pussy. Pussy. We goes to one man as we get started again. Here's a little bit of go left. Tony Duggan. There's a sense of real urgency to this attack. Genuine chance. And there's three in front now. My queen. What a performance this has been so far. Relaxed. Get it. Get on my track. Mohamed Salah. It's high. Edging ever closer to goal here. That's a nice cutback. And it's a good diving save, although one you'd expect to be made. It's put into the middle. And that's a corner that's simply been played straight into the keeper's gloves. Breaking at pace, this could be dangerous. Now for the finish. And another goal. It seemed all over before, but there's another to really seal it. No need to stop the play. On they go. Still going here. And now they've lost it. Good reading of the game. Played their way into danger here. Nah. Yeah, I'm not going to um, sing this. So. Oh, that's racist, right? But I mean, like, it's just wow. Body in the way. <laughs> it's a challenge that's brought a whistle and a free kick. The way that puts it, looking down the map, pizza, red ass. Distribution from the keeper. Lovely ball. Now, what can they do with it? And away from danger it goes. Beckham 
I actually don't know whether to have Beckham on the team because he adds value, obviously. Have a lot of value. <laughs> I don't know. And the wrong side of the defense, offside. Chance now for a quick transition. Pushing nicely upfield here. Oh, he's I'm afraid that. that's where it ends for them. Are they all greedy as well. Challenge. Oh, it's still in there. Yeah. Well, that's hugely frustrating for the coach and the players. Got the afterburners on. Oh, that's it back. Well, the danger's still there, and that must be so disappointing for them. Lovely ball. This could lead to something. Yeah, I was going to say, there's a problem there somewhere. Foul. Free kick to come. Stanway. Okay. And the game comes to an end with the home fans in positive mood. I've been live three quarters now. Are you fucking men? So clinical. Took them apart. Mental. Uh, I need to. Put Duggan on to a next stage, right? Okay. So this gives a two pace, two shooting, two passing, two physical, and power shot. 84 rated. But the next one gives a three more pace, three more shooting, five dribbling. This card, if it. Oh, what game is it? Oh, no, it isn't. Why? Yeah, this card gets technical as well from it. Yeah, the dribbling is going to be nuts. The shooting is going to be nuts. Composure 91, by the way. She's going to. Wait, did she have Relentless from the last one? She must have. Press for even and technical. Yeah, that card's nutty. Let the sun, 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 sun lie. And summer is over. Summer is over. You let the moon, moon, moon. You can have another contract, of course. Summer is over. Uh, managers out of contract. Jesus, I don't even need that manager. Nice kit that you make. All welcome to iconic Anfield. I'm Guy Mowbray, and I'm joined by Sue Smith for commentary. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's the Founders, and they take on the Krakens. Thanks, Guy. Well, I can't wait for this one. Both sets of fans are certainly up for it. I'm sure. So you know, a good team. It's not as good boost. as the last one. They'll be hoping to start the game at a fast tempo. I don't like Russo and Cam anymore. But Duggan is going to be my backup striker. Good pace and build up, but not quite the end product. And it's on now. Oh, I don't believe it. A sensational challenge. And this is how the founders team looks today. 
Yeah, it looks like a 4-3-3, and they are really good out wide. The relationships with both wingers and fullbacks are great, and the latter constantly providing overlaps to create 2v1 situations. Both have got good delivery, so it's just about getting on the end of things. Here's the lineup for the Krakens. Allison is in goal. Jude Bellingham plays alongside Pedri Fuck. in central midfield. And they'll play with a lone striker up front to take the lead. And he's done really well to keep that out. Go out. Has to be. Oh, what a... She hits it so quick. Really good save that was. Delivered into the box. And it's there. This the is why she's the, the goat. 1 0 then as we get started again. Mudry. Now Bellingham. Jared Bowie. Bellingham. Pedri. The ball back with the founders now. Jordan Witema. Moving forward well. What a chance. Oh, this <laughs> She's the Again, goat. I'm telling you guys. Time. And it's it's crazy, but mine was a free evolution where you can pay 50k to do her now, but she's not as quick. She has better shooting than dribbling, but honestly it's maxed out shooting anyway, so don't worry Tony about it. Of saves, Ooh. but you'd expect him Ooh. to probably stop that. Again, 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 again. Untidy in possession there. Ooh. I'm looking forward to using my team again, but I'm Neto. obviously I won't be using that for another like nine games. Oh, I forgot to get those packs on. for um, the other king. So, no, it's not a problem. To the box it goes. All sorted out by Zambrotta. Real oh. opportunity. Mudrik. Pedri. Great chance here. And the keeper more than equal to it. And the ball comes in. Oh, block. on the line and the referee sees that as a foul free kick to come Just sitting off here, inviting pressure. And she's being urged to shoot. And it's a pretty good save by the keeper. Well, we can see it here again, but it was pretty clear when it happened. The ball was nowhere near over the line, and that's just confirmed it. Pressure on. It'll be another corner. And that one should easily be cleared. And this could be oh, a great chance. Oh, well. The referee points to the spot. Who Penalty. takes pens now? Oh, you know what? I, oh my god, that was very quick. <laughs> that was dreadful. <laughs> I need some food. What have we got? 
Kill it with the squirrelies. Go on, lad. And that's all there is mm. for the first half. Oh, go him. Here at Off we go. The second half underway. Nice ball to switch the play. Oh, they looked in there. That's nicely cut out. Martinez. On to Pedri. Now, there could be something on in a moment. And that's where it ends. Well, a bit of a clumsy challenge, and the ref blows for a free kick. How am I only team that up? And it's missed by quite a way and would have had to have been special to score from there anyway. Yeah, he's way off target and that's a good position to test the goalkeeper. Just put it in a good area and let someone attack it. His teammates certainly won't be happy with that. Promising position this. And it's on now. It's stop in. that. And of course it's in. It's a master. Not uh, Russo, I mean, to uh, try and stop that. Man. Bellingham. He's beaten his man here. And it's there. And he's put that one away very nicely indeed. That was fucking dumb, wasn't it? Oh, they just uh, decide to actually play now. That's a shame for them. Nothing doing. Go. There's surely no This king is actually exceptional. Making good progress here. Pulls it back. And it's a decent That's actually a really good save. And the corner is fired in. It's wide. A looper. It looked like a really good headed chance. As the stats show, you just wonder how many this could be because the way that they go forward, it's great to watch. So much creativity and the defence just can't cope with them. Surely the manager will make a change soon. Zambrotta. And the cross comes in. Well, any chance has gone for now. The counter looks on here. Options available. Offside. Was looking good. Ultimately, nothing doing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Is that Pacheco? I would like a Pacheco. Um, Founders recovering evolution. possession well. What too many centre backs for it? Not getting close enough here. Oh, against the bar. That beautiful. That dribbling in. Oh, that come on. Was looking good, but there it's ended. Good effort to stop the it just ball. Just looks going like out. it can. There's a good from the left. Here. Those in the middle won't be happy about that service. Oh. Well, that's how to clear it. Lautaro Martinez. I forgot that I've got that Kane in as well. Fucking hell. Oh, I have in. a lot of players. And the 
keeper more than equal to it. Tony Duggan. Just needs the composure now. That's brilliant, though. That's a way in which you win a game by one. That's the final whistle. Four. Positive result, at least as well, well, far as the home fans well, are concerned. Well, well. Sue, what did you make of... Well, that was an emphatic result. And they went forward. You thought they were... All right. I'm one game away. I just need to win a game. Wow. <laughs> and I get 86, Tony Duggan. Right. Uh, we actually have a couple of packs for you guys. I've got an 80 times 2. And I have an 81 times 2. Uh, and I'm closing in on those. But I've, I've, got, I've still got four days to play six games. I'll play two more in this episode. Get some nice packs from that. Right, let's open these packs and then get into the next couple of games. Gentlemen, come. Fry Gang. Bully! 81 times 2. Italian, then the mead. Oh, it's probably a woman. Was locked out. Yeah, it's a woman. Eighty-three Caruso. Bull. <laughs> Bull. Right. Let's play it against this lot. Oh no, McCabe. You're out of contract, my dear. Oh dear. I have some I have some fantastic cards in my club. That's such a dead kit, that Lon's kit. Anfield, one of the most storied venues I need a banger. Something lift me up. So it looks good. Go with me. usual is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's the Founders versus the Raptors. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch. My mind said on you. I got my mind said on you. I got my mind set on you. I got my mind set on you. Well, it's a 4 3 3 with two out and out wingers. But they do it's it, told it hype, hype. I just don't like Madison in this game. He's just a bit poo. Well, they've decided to make a change. Am I right in thinking it's international break now? Oh, he's given the ball away. Not for the women's though. Themselves yeah. into a good position. I got my mindset on you. 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 And let's give credit to the defending. Turn. Love that, Fran. All she did was turn. <laughs> Love that. What a ball, Tony. I got my mindset on you. I got my mindset on you. I got my mindset on you. All out of precious money. Fidel. Dessers. I do realise, by the way, but I've been playing a long time with uh, squad numbers wrong. It's just because I need to redesign my team because there's actually a few changes. Well, it certainly wasn't an easy chance, but one they needed to do it to do. But I need to do these objectives first. 
regains possession. I got my mouth on you. I got my mouth on you. I got my mouth on you. Sit on you. I got my mouth set on you. My mouth set on you. I got my mouth set on you. You know what? I feel like this is actually going to sound really weird because I'm 30 years old. <laughs> but because I do quite a lot of my dates from 9 till half 5, I get home about 6 and I've, I've then I'm get on FIFA for a bit. And then afterwards, I'm looking forward to playing COD. I feel like I'm back in school, but I'm 30 years old. Is, is that weird? Is that actually weird that, like, I excited? <laughs> Brandon, I just see, I just, I just see a message. Wait, I was singing ages ago. You must be far behind. It's a good song. Bang it. Wait, you just got me a gay basket. You've got pillows that say, like, um, that's gay, I'm in. Technically, if you're gay, you're out, not in. So not that I need to be out smart being really gay. I'm not gay myself. I've never up. looked at a guy and go, whoa. <laughs> Actually, that's a lie. I do it with Darwin yeah. Nunes all the time, don't I? I think every guy, realistically, has, oh yeah, has one uh, guy. <laughs> I think every guy has one guy that they would go gay for. A lot of people would say David Beckham, uh, which is my era. However, like, Beckham's not really... Because like, I'm a Liverpool fan, so obviously he was ex-United. Um, but, like, he's a, he's a very handsome devil. You know what? For me, growing up, it was Fernando Torres. I would say, like, Fernando Torres, like... When he signed for Liverpool 2007, on my birthday actually, that is a fun fact, he signed on my birthday, so what a birthday present he was, um, but I would say now it would be uh, Darwin Nunes, I think everyone, I, I think everyone has that, I don't know if for like women they have like a woman, though. actually I'd probably say if I had to guess it would be like Margot Robbie or Rihanna, actually Rihanna's not really about but it used to be like Rihanna. Um, the who, what other women are there Defender that women would go gay for? I don't actually know. Actually, I know someone's, but they actually are bisexual, so that doesn't really count. Because I know that like Ella, like Brandon will know who Ella is. Um, her like celebrity crush is Lucy Bronze. Listen, it's just interesting. I think everyone just has like that one person where, obviously, it would never happen. So that's why you can say it with like chest. Because realistically, if I had the chance with Darwin Nunes, I would absolutely say no. But like, you 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 say it just because like, oh, it's a, it's a gorgeous man. I think it is footballers. I think it must be a football. Like, it's a sports thing. Actually, no, no one goes. Uh, no one used to say like, uh, no no guy would go like, oh, Andy Murray does it for me. You know, I'm in. It's just, oh, what save. I think it must be like footballs, maybe like maybe rugby players as well, because it's like a well, actually no, football's not a macho sport, but like rugby is. Maybe it's just football. Maybe like football fans on the whole are pretty gay for footballers, aren't they? So simple. As you can tell, I'm just waffling because this game is too easy. I see Brandon typing. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. But no one looks at actually. So a personnel change then. 
Joe Marler. Who's Joe Marler? Yo mama. That's Joe Mama. <laughs> and a good challenge. Who's Joe Marler? To an end. Breaking at pace. They need to get bodies back. And still danger here. I have no idea who Joe Marler is. Let me Google him. It's going to be like a porn star with a massive well, cock. Those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will. Oh, rugby. Yeah. Really <laughs> <defenders. laughs> Their attack play has been excellent. That looks like, like Nyan Golan on steroids. Well, and Nyan Golan the looks like he's on... <laughs> let's give credit to the that picture, though. That picture you just sent you. Ashley Neville. I swear that's just like... That, I swear that's Cy on steroids. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Not well, one bit. I'm trying to think of any male actors. Well, she's looking really sharp um, here. Really does deserve to get uh, a hat trick. That would go gay for. Taylor. I don't know. Well, had no intention of losing out. Danny Brandon wants better asking. rough and tumble. I thought he was going to be like a fisherman or something. It's like. You'd go. You'd go for gay for Spooner, right? You, a good intervention. Let's realise I've only scored four goals. Cuts it back. Let's change that. Rocks it brilliantly. Well, it's great when you can I'm. I'm sorry, but this keeper's nutty. And a confident clearance. And Fair she's good. done it. She's made it a hat trick. <laughs> She's tearing this defence apart. What an individual performance. I know who Grant would choose for his uh, guy, but he'd go gay for. And I know who... And that's an important intervention. Mm. Can they convert? And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Alessia Russo. Some guys, I, that, this is actually a, a actually quite a relevant topic. Actually, I know we're talking about like uh, who would, like who guys would like have sex with and stuff, but I I think there's so many guys out there that wouldn't want to be with a say a women's football player because they do what some guys would dream to do say so like a, a proper like football fan guy would i think there's quite a lot of that would not want to be with a professional female player because they do what they would love to do as a profession like say if i don't know for instance like no, but no, right, so, right, this is what I'm saying, Brandon. Like, you, you're fine with it, because the thing is, though, but... That I, f I know that there's a lot of sexist people that think that, like, oh, just because they can't be a footballer, they don't want to be with someone that is a footballer. But realistically, if, say, I was with a professional female player, and I would want... I would like vicariously want them to do better because they are living out the dream. But I actually, I never had dreamt of being a footballer. But I just think some people are just so narrow minded and actually believe that, like, if they can't have it, no one can have it. Maybe, like, I don't know, it's, it's a weird one. I'm Mappy Leon. <laughs> right, Tony Duggan is done now. So she is. Um, 86 rated. It's a very good card. It's not a great card, but it's a very good card. Oh, I, I should have tried to do the glitch. To be fair, I'm, I'm playing one more game in this stream, and I will be able to get Nelson up to the 76 rated. And he's went halfway there, because I need to do another 20 games. <sighs> and then, but the thing is, I need to get him done. He's got 10, game, uh, 10 days left, I should say. Not 10 games. Um... I don't think I have any more objectives. No, I'm still free away from those. 
I need to play Rival at some point and just actually play games, but Rivals is just long and I'm just not in a good actually am I close to the I'm five away from that. Oh, I'm two away from that. But that I'll get those to get that tomorrow then. And I will be completing that one tomorrow. So I'll get a fifty K pack and an eighty three times five tomorrow, which is very nice to be fair. Um Right, let's play another game. Uh, da, da, da. You know what? I'm going to play the best team because it'll keep me up. Every team has fucking... Mo fucking Modric is 93 rated. That card is actually nuts. I didn't realise. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How does this person... Actually, yeah, you can get XP from anything. If you're in a high division, you can, you're can you already there. It's a good team. It's a good team. Uh, no, I don't want to copy squad. I want to play it. Uh, so, Tony Duggan. We're going to see what she's like with 90 pace. 95 shooting, I think. It's a very good card. That dribbling stat's nuts. 96 finishing but the thing is 91 composure is fucking unbelievable 92 acceleration uh, 88 sprint speed it should feel gorgeous that card um you know let's just take someone out i i, want, I might want to try that cough but I have so many special cards at some level. I love that picture, by the way. That, That's so good. She's singing that song. I've, to be fair, I actually have seen the press junket pictures of uh, that Chelsea Williams. I've seen uh, Guru Wrighton's card. She, like, the pictures are sick. What do I put? Oh, I, I, I was meaning to put a... Um... I'm not up in a. I'm not up in a sh um, pass uh, shooting at all. Don't need it. Uh, but actually, I'm just going to show you how nutty this card it actually is. 89 acceleration, 89 sprint speed, 92 short pass, 92 long pass, 85 composure, 84. K that is unbelievable. And you know what? I would probably say that's the best spread play styles I've seen. From an, yes, she doesn't have a play style plus, which a lot of people will be put off by that card. But she has, look, in an ideal world, it would be finesse. But I'm not um, bothered about that. Pinged pass is fantastic. Long pass is fantastic. Whip pass is fantastic. Anticipate is by far the best defending one. Press proving is fantastic. Uh, actually, first touch I'd probably say is the best one. Actually, no, no, technical and rapid are good, but relentless is superb and Travella is fantastic. You know, that's fun. That's fantastic. I'll say fantastic again. Very, 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 very good. And she is likely to go up because Chelsea are nuts right now. They are top of the WSL. Obviously, this is a Champions League card, but I think that's a brilliant card. Eighty-four squad I need. I put Erling Haaland and a lot of people will say why did you put Erling Haaland into an 84 rate squad? The reason for it is two reasons. One, he's only worth 100k. Actually there's three reasons. One, he's only worth 100k. Doesn't matter. I put, I've put in De Bruyne into SBCs. I've put Griezmann into SBCs. Um, most likely, eventually I'll put Salah into it but Salah does have the best playstyle plus in the game so probably not. Uh, and I'm a Liverpool fan. The second one being he doesn't get my team. Russo is unbelievable. Tony Duggan I've um, upgraded. I've got plenty of those. And the third being, we all get an Erling Haaland for free <laughs> next month. And it's a special card. I hate non-special cards. As you can tell, <laughs> I don't have a, a non-special card. And it actually really annoys me that Salah is fantastic. He just, I just don't want, like to see that normal card. The Evolution cards have been amazing. Like, look how good that Greenwood card is. That kit is fucking gorgeous, by the way. As much as I hate to say that, being a Liverpool fan. That is a boring card. I've, I've got two Madison cards, and they're both boring. 
even that card looks sick. Like, I'd love the design of the Euro. That Watkins card, I think, is one of the most beautiful cards on this game. Um, what is the most like eye-catching card I could? It's like I've got this Greenwood, but I'll take seven pace and a better-looking card, and it's cheap. Uh, Hertha got a first uh, WSL goal, goal last night. It was actually a very good finish. There's some, uh, there's some beautiful cards. I don't know why. I think all squad foundation cards should have had a um, a thingy um, a dynamic image. I am actually waiting for a Chloe Kelly. Um, uh, it's going to take ages for an evolution to come out to where it's 88 pace. I would like a Chloe Kelly one because this is first owner. I factor twice. First owner now. I like this Kiernan. You know what? I actually want to try this Kiernan out. Put her on the bench. It's, she's probably not worth the Hunter card on it, though. Wait, I already have Catalyst. Where the fuck did I get them from? I don't know why all the hero ones are fuzzy. What the fuck has happened to these cards? And why is it just them and not Frank Kirby? But even that Kirby... Um, that's a poor Photoshop, I just realised. Look at her hair and look at her face. That is cut out really shit. <laughs> I've only just noticed that, but only because it's taken ages to... Uh, do I put Cuthbert in for this game? Yeah, come on, let's try, let's try Cuthbert. Let's give her a debut. Why not? Uh, right. Get Eliza Cuthbert in. Oh, just, I, I, I find some of this shit on this game funny. Thanks, Guy. Well, being in and around the ground before kickoff, the fans are buzzing. They can't wait for this game. So hopefully, it's a fast-paced, entertaining match. Also, I want to do a. I haven't. I, I totally forget to keep today. doing a stat yeah, check. A the front three are gonna need to right, let's see well what this. Sure the striker isn't too isolated. If it's on one side, can the other winger come in and be that second centre forward? Has to be. Yeah, well, that that that. Any day of the week. Uh, yeah, she doesn't need to be on. I'm gonna put Kin in right wing. We're going to bring on Stanway there, but I want to put them, swap them around. Stanway could be in an opposite position. Midfield three of Stanway, Elatuna, and Cuthbert. <laughs> I know Beckham technically is better than all of them, but I'm a bit bored of Beckham now. <laughs> he probably will get back into my side because. To be fair, he's made my club captain for a long time. Oh, which, to be really fair, will go to Williamson. I think. Oh, ooh, Stanway Goes captain, you know. Who says no? Who says no to Georgia Stanway as my club captain? I've been pushing all game for her to get into my team constantly. Oh, Katie McCabe. You know what? She's captain material. Oh, go on, kid. Well, they didn't find the equaliser there, did they? But that what was boots has she got? On? They look sexy. Do all of my team have dynamic, uh, not dynamic, with face guns? Neville does. Weird hair though. And she looks a bit like. You know what? She looks like Kai Rooney. She does actually look like Kai Rooney. Mad. Jo Leah Williamson. Lily King just looked massive. You know what? They they nailed Katie McCabe. That sounds good. Cuthbert looks a bit like Sean Longstaff. <laughs> what the fuck is that hair? That that's awful texture, but yeah, is what it is. Obviously, the go. Oh look, she 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 she, she 
she's looking this way. <laughs> Guys, she's looking this way. <laughs> um, Frank Kirby looks incredible on this game. Tony Duggan. Wow, Kinnan actually has her face. I, f I swear her card is so low rated. That hair is sick, though. That hair is sick. Oh, those boots are sexy. You know what? Little gem, little gem. First owner, you know? Just saying. Well, with that sort of chance, you really ought to do a bit better. I did not expect Kinnan to have her face again. That's actually nuts. Georgia Stanway. And she's done well to get past. Possession oh. lost just at the point of something Who happening. Who the fuck was that? Marcos Llorente. This is a good run. Now, can he pick out the right option? Duggan. Mm. Might be offside. Pulls it back. Ah. Results in the flag going up for offside. It's careless this. She has other options. She should have held on to it a bit longer. Just give your teammate a bit more time. Referee, touch me bum. No, not the referee touched my bum. But... Oh, great work. What's next? Picked out nicely. I'm the sorry, but why am I team struggling? Oh, actually, I just realised it's actually a very high rated team. Whoops. Founders <laughs> have the ball again. Ah. Right, let's focus actually. Focus up. Play That's on it. is the referee's call. Keeping it nicely, waiting for the chance to draw level. He'll have a go here, but the nice. keeper saw it coming and Good saves time. easily. Aldridge. Nice king. Go Fran. Go Fran. Go Fran. You can leave Blanc away. Nice cutback. Go in. It's a corner and possibly the chance to go further in front. Only half the job done there. Ah. Stanway. I should have gone to uh, Kinnan. Did she just live offside this time? encouraging. But good defending to snuff out any threat. Today this could be the greatest day of all life. I didn't even put um, music back in. Now for the finish. And Come the on, Tony. Love that, you cheeky bitch. Off we go. Two I, I said that. Now. That was a bit weird. Bamba. Bamba. Bamba club. Oh. Mordrich. You know what, right. What, to finish off the, um, the stream after this game, I want to do some. Dangerous. Now, this has to be. Terrific. Another goal. What a scoreline this is for I want to do something. I need a special woman's goalkeeper. JJ Okocha. Jonathan Bamba. Allowed to go a long way with this. Oh, shit. Oh, worth a shot. Well, he's kept that out nicely. I want to do that something. And I close, think first... it could be the start of something beautiful. And there's the restart. Off we go again. I just realised I've got two evenings after today to get seven wins on Rivals. I want to play COD. I don't want to play fucking rivals. Had to be, but wasn't. Am I gonna live up my guns if I can't play? And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. I think. I think I'm gonna have to sacrifice. I'm, I'm gonna have to just play rivals tomorrow night, just constantly. Well, she's Get at least like five wins or something. So far. What have you That's made beautiful. Touch out your feet. To Bang. And, and the dirt is gone. 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 Two. And away we go again at four nil now. 
my neck really hurts when I do this. I don't know if it's me like playing FIFA all weekend. I'm just like sat forward like this, or I sleep funny on it. It's been like that for a few days. Maybe I'm just old. That too. You know what, Duggan? You know what? She actually has the perfect um, work rate. If she was four four, like. I don't even care free star. People go, oh, she's only got free star week four. Shut up. And that's where it ends. With it really loss. does not matter. Okay, she's just here. a willing runner. Oh, Ken, and you're always offside. Luka Modric. On he goes, terrific. Uh. The what a save, dude! Deck. What a save! Into the box it goes. Oh, it's a really good header, but it's met Bum. by a more than decent save. And cleared behind Bum. for another corner. Mm. It's only halfway clear. Come on, Georgia. Love that. And Love that. Love that. Down. Duggan. Unless he wants. Oh, she's gone past it. Just him, I should say. Oh, talk about reactions. How good were his then? It's such close Oosh. range. Well, she's got two now, and she's playing a star. <laughs> and off we go again with the gap now a full five to nothing. I'm so, I'm so, I'm so chill right now. I'm just scrolling Instagram. Lovely ah, she's offside. Ball, and the game will stop. Offside. I haven't noticed Cuthbert, and I don't know if that's a good thing in my team or not because everyone gets involved. And this could be, and that's a great bit of goalkeeping. That's what he's there for. That's nice. Good give and go. Duggan. Oh. Read the pass well and cuts it out. Modric. I don't know whether to start. Have a go here. Still for or Toon. No, it's got to be Toon. Toon's well, more expensive. It's a fantastic initial save, though. This is looking good. Now, what comes ah. next? And that's a shame for them. Nothing doing. Uh. By the way, I will be streaming, Cod. I will be. Nice. Kenan, you're onside. Wow. <laughs> no, I'm confused. I'm giving away the ball because I thought you might have been offside. JJ Okacha. Dude, let's go. I don't care. My eyelids are a bit sore. It's put into the middle. I don't know if look well, given not. the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Fantastic. Uh. What's the keeper doing here? Oh, it's still in there. And nothing coming from their play in the end. Duggan. The fans is showing good width here. And the game comes to an Perfect end result. with the home Five fans now. in positive mood. Have fab. Right. right, let's chill the fuck out. Oh yeah, I was thinking, wait, hang on, what do you mean? <laughs> I forgot, yeah, um, my man Reese is <laughs> halfway there. <laughs> In games wise, that is. He's still got two more stages. Um, right. But to end the episode, what I am going to do is build my team. So I'm actually going to delete a lesser's allure. Because we are starting new. And we are going to call it, yes, you guessed it.
Alessia's a law. Wait, did, oh, it's Alessia a law. Damn it! I can't even spell it right. Alessia's a law. Yes. First try. Right. There we go. Let's build the new team. Okay. In goal. Do deck. I know. Okay. I'm not going to do that for everyone. Uh, Georgia Stanway. Okay. So far. It's exactly the same. And to be fair, most of, this, most of it is going to be exactly the same. But here is the good part. Because every player now is Barclays Women's Super League. Left back is going to be Alex Greenwood. <laughs> Round of applause. You know what? Because we don't need a, a good manager... We're going to have the best manager, Jurgen Klopp, just cause. Right, at right back, we are going to have Gary Neville. <laughs> Gary Neville, regen and non-sexist. No, it's Ashley Neville. No relation, I don't believe so. Okay, left centre back, built like a brick shit house, like a tank. Millie Bright. Are you picking up what I'm putting down? And to complete my defence, it is... Leah Williamson. Yeah, you guessed it. Well, all in my own full chem already, except for Georgia Stanway, because she sodded off to Germany. She probably should have stayed with Man City, but it doesn't matter. At right centre mid, it's not David Beckham. It is the brand new 85 road to the knockout Champions League women's Eliza Cuthbert. <laughs> Lovely card. And in centre attack mid, she has cost me 150,000 coins. The fake eyelashes herself. Ella Toon. I've got a United player now because I don't discriminate against twats. Uh, to be fair, I have nothing against um, Man United Women's to be fair. Okay. Here's where it gets techy. Not really. You kind of know what the team's going to be. At left wing, we are not going with an out and out left wing. We're not going with Hurtig. We're not going with Tony Duggan, who I've just spent another 50k on this card. This card has cost me 100,000 coins. I'm going with someone that cost me 26,500 coins. Normally a left back can play fucking anywhere on the pitch. And she does, to be fair, for Ireland and Arsenal women's. It is... Katie McCabe. I'm just going to clap out everyone. This does get full cam. I just realised. It does get full cam. I was thinking, shit, what if I don't buy? I just realised that the other two are. At right wing, standing in at five foot two, it is not Alicia Lehman, who is considerably tall. Not really that much tall. There's only three inches. Three inches is a lot, though. Women, there is out. But like I, I do miss Alicia, Alicia Lehman. It's not Chloe Kelly because she is still gold. We're not going with Tony Duggan, even though she's cost me 100,000 coins. And I'm not going with Van Sander because, quite frankly, she freaks me the fuck out because she has next to no hair, but incredibly red lips. <laughs> Uh, plus light to be fair, medium low just sucks to be fair. We are going at five foot two, awfully photoshopped Fran Kirby. Big shout out to Fran Kirby actually. Quickly before I carry on with this like weird section, um, she obviously decided to take a break from 
um well, basically the women's game obviously she got injured as well but um she took time away from the game both international level and club level because she was suffering from mental uh mental health uh she was getting bullied online um from fucking disgusting cretin scum um body shaming and all sorts so incredible to see frank kirby back scoring for england scoring for chelsea and all around being an absolute little superstar so well done um fran and everyone is here to support you not that you're watching the lessons of law but you should because we're on episode 80 after and we haven't even done two months i don't think but anyway on to the final um on, on to the final position and you guessed it standing at five foot eight the tallest in the team? Oh, okay. No, five foot ten. She's taller by it than Leah Williamson. Five foot seven as well, yeah. Five foot four. Five foot four. I have a five foot four midfield. I just realised that. Five foot five or five foot two. No, but standing in at five foot eight, it is the legend who Yes, it's not Tony Duggan who's cost me 100,000 coins. It is a player that cost me absolutely nothing, even to upgrade her. And because she is first only sit at one underneath the Hunter badge, it is the beautiful, the amazing Alessia Russo, who I have named this series after. Welcome to the team. Look at that team. It is women. And do deck. But anyway, onto the bench. Not really giving this much thought, but who gives a fuck? Right, let's take that away. Let's find two strikers that we are having in the team. And you know what? Despite the fact we have all of these fantastic players who, for the most part, are men, except for the summer, but she kind of is quite masculine. Um, we are going second page, and we are finally choosing the player that cost me 100,000 coins, and that is Tony Duggan. Welcome to the team, if I can actually click her in. There we go. Absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Right, on to the second one. You know what? I might actually have three strikers on the bench, just realised. Because for the second one, again, is not anyone on this first page. Not even the brand new, who I haven't used yet, Flashback Giroud or Flashback Iago Aspas. It's not even Francescoli. It's not even Harry Kane. It's not even Ollie Watkins. It is 85 rated Jordan Heitemer. I think that's how you say your name. I think so. And then third in our list of... Um, players that we're going on is another striker it is no one from the first or second page she is on the f oh my god I, I want four strikers on the bench I just realised but we are not going with Brun uh, Bruna who cost me 50,000 coins we are going with Leanne Kiernan who I believe probably will probably be more come on as a winger. Same with Heitema, to be fair. So that's why I've chosen three strikers. You can see the theme I'm going here. I'm going women. Right, midfielders now. <laughs> uh, I haven't thought this far ahead. So it's none of these. Let me try and th think of someone before I put them in. I could have a minge. That card actually looks nuts, but I haven't used minge yet, have I? Yeah. Or Lubin. Actually, you know what? No, I need another attacker. What am I on about? I need a winger. Of course it is. 50,000 coins used to live here. Now it's some layman. <laughs> that joke didn't work. Uh, I'm going to put a hawk on it. <laughs> 50,000 coins used to live here. Now it was a layman. <laughs> I like that. Uh, that's a pretty cool ref. Uh, anyway, um, now I need two centre mids. And I think 
I've come up with a banger. Beckham's not on the bench. No, you're right. No, he's he's on the bench. <laughs> I was about to say, there's no way I can't have Beckham not on the bench. We're not having Kone or Rice on the bench anymore. We're not having Bowen. Might be Benini actually thinking about it. Lasada, it's not Lasada, even though she's told me to shush. Wow, I don't have many midfielders, do I? Okay, I'm going Benini. Fat pound for pound, one of the best midfielders on this game. And then I need a defender. I need a hero. And I have options here. I actually do have options. We can't go Greenwood or Williamson because we've got a, a different variation in the club. We can go Jess Carter. We can go Letitia Santos, who is five foot two, probably not going to go her. Um, Kuka as well, not going to go her. Jess Carter is five foot five, uh, but she is very good. I am tempted by Patton. I am tempted by Rule. I think down the line it's going to be Maritz. Um, but we are going to put in our second man. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm happy with that. Um, I'm going to put in Joel Matip. It's nice how he was first owner. Shame how Duggan wasn't, but it doesn't It doesn't matter. On on, on these ones, I, 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 it, you can't put first owner. Even though this is the first owner, this is like a one-of-one one card. Unless someone wanted to copy me, which is fair enough. But that is the team. So my back four, well, back five, all has dynamic images. The only dynamic image-less cards are Russo, Toon, and Stanway. Arguably three of the best players in the team. Yeah. We've got fucking Gary Neville, 88 rated. What a team that is, by the way. I'm just saying, like we're less than a couple of months into this game, and I have an unbelievable team. And right, this is to put into context. Let's go on special, and we'll go into the Barclays Women's Super League. We still have all of these for a Women's Super League. Like, Lasada is a very good player, but let's be honest, Cuthbert's better. I've got a, effectively the same Greenwood. I've got Martha Thomas, who is smashing it. For um, Tottenham, now that she's left Man United. Van der Sanders scares the shit out of me. I'm not using that. Her tick is fantastic, to be fair. 143 games, 67 goals, 54 assists. Jess Carter's amazing. This Maritz will go up to 86. Um, I want to get Nelson done first just because he's only got 10 days left. I've used her so many times. Patton is fantastic. Rule. Realistic, I, sh I don't need her anymore, but it don't matter. It don't matter. But that team is nuts. That is such a fucking good team. I love it. I love it. But yeah, let, leave your thoughts about what, how, how, what you think of my team because, yes, I understand. The power curve is. W this is my team. The power curve is, it's off, it's off my face cam, I can't see it up there, I really can't see it up there. But, what I will say about my team is, there is a small possibility, it's not impossible, but there is a small possibility that no one on this game has the exact same team as me. There is no way that, that there is isn't. there is a way where... People have done these two, uh, these three cards. There is a chance, but saying that, that's 300k between these two, by the way. So maybe they, they, they've gone with like men. If they have gone with them, then probably have gone with these because they are they were two of the best ones for that specific one. I'm pretty sure this card is a one of one card. Look at the shine on it when it goes past in a sec. <laughs> I'm taking the piss out of this. I'm, I'm really taking the piss. I'm, I'm milking it a bit. But it's just... It's fantastic that these cards exist. And you've got the freedom to do these cards. This card cost me 
100,350 coins. And I'm only the second owner. Thank you whoever sold me this card for 350 coins. Because I've just made it into this. And you've got to think, right. Let me just get her base card up. Quickly. She started with 72 pace. So she's gone up 10. 77 shooting. She's gone up 12. 66 passing. She's gone up 10. 76 dribbling. She's gone up 13. Defence is the same. <laughs> Physical has only gone up 3. But the three stats I look for most for a striker is pace, but it's not the most important. It's actually third on, like, how important it is. Shooting, dribbling, pace. I've got nearly two stats in 90. It's an unbelievable card. She can play four different positions. She's got four play styles now. One power shot. Technical, relentless. There are two that I, I'm, I'm loving. I'm press proven is. I love this team and I love I love what I've done with this because it's a it to me. I would not be doing the, playing this game still at this point. I know we're less than two months in, or actually about two months in, to this game. I would still not be doing this series if it wasn't for these players on my screen. And this is like this is not a rant. This is just me being like passionate about this. I. Finish work, I get home, and I look forward to playing this game. I don't think I've ever felt this way about any FIFA game before. I've been um, addicted to, like... <coughs> I've just got a nasty taste in my... I've been addicted to, like, career modes in different FIFAs. But I've never been addicted to Ultimate Team. The the community as a whole are toxic, but there is nothing better, no better feeling, no better satisfaction for getting one over on some community members with a team of women. And it's because of the addition of women that has made this game truly fantastic. I don't, I can't fathom in my head how anyone who has a full team of men when they've added something so different but the thing is so different but at the same time so normal because these are all very fucking good football players <coughs> and deserve to be on this game deserve to be like these sort of cards it's a celebration of how fantastic women's football is i've said it so many times in the 80 episodes I've done, I've probably spoken about it a good 20, 30 times. How fantastic it is to have women on this game. And although, yes, I still have one man in my squad. It's because goalkeeper, it's it's one of those um, stigma positions. Because realistically, you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't. If I chose a woman... Obviously, right now, there isn't any uh, special card women um, player, so I, it's unattainable. And if there was, I'd probably still choose to do that just purely on the basis of that, like, naturally, women are shorter than men when it comes to... Because you see how many goals go in in WSL where, like, realistically, if it was a man in goal, I'm not... This isn't sexist, by the way. Because they're naturally taller, there's more chance of them saving. Not saying they will save it, because some of the shots in 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 a women's game are fucking unbelievable. They definitely rival men's. Um, but like, there was a couple of goals last night where I thought if it was like a quality keeper and goal, a quality keeper that's taller, if the if women like could be over six foot tall, <coughs> um, and there'd be a influx of that, then. It'd be interesting, to say at least. But, I don't know. I, I just think that I accept the fact that I will lose more games than the average player. But I 
know for a fact I have more fun and more enjoyment and more passion for it using this. I, I, you might have noticed like, I'm a big Liverpool fan. I'm wearing a Liverpool like training shirt. I've got a Ian Rush um, 1992-1993 um, shirt on my chair. I've got like loads of Liverpool shirts. I'm a huge Liverpool fan. You might notice I've hardly I've hardly used any Liverpool players. Yes, I've used Matip because um, it was that evolution as you see it on my bench. I've used Salah because I packed him. Uh, I've used Trent because I packed him. I've used Darwin because I'm a big fan of Darwin. But even then, he's just gone out of the team now. It's very easy for me just to use the Liverpool team. And I know down the line I'm going to do a Liverpool career. So what's the point of me just spending time using them for hundreds and hundreds of games on Ultimate Team? Just to use them on a career. I haven't used Saboslai on this game. Even though I'm a big fan of his and his card actually is good. I could have quite easily spent 50k and getting an insane Saboslai card. But I get more satisfaction. I'm more like, um, I'm more eager and I'm more... Um, excited to see what evolutions I can do with like WSL players. I've done evolutions um, for someone like right, this is prime example, Charlie's Roll. I've never seen her play. But I looked at it and thought, you know what, this actually turns into quite a nice evolution. I don't know you. Like, yes, I've done evolutions on players I do know quite a bit about because I've watched like England women's and I've watched like big teams play like I knew about Alex Greenwood I've known about her for years so it was I and like I've known about Ella Toon for a good few years like George Stanway I've known for years uh, Leah Williamson I've known for years Russo I've known for years but this game has enabled me to learn about players before this like game came out I won't lie. I've, I probably like. I might have seen a couple of things about Kate McKay, but I, I wouldn't know who she is. I've learned so much about her. I knew about Frank Kirby for years, and like, I'm delighted about she's got a card. I've known of Neville for a bit, but this season I've learned more about her. Millie Bright, I've known because of England, and like I've, I've spoken about her. Uh, Tony Duggan, I've known for years, and that's why I, ch I chose her for the starter, uh, like starter evolution, and. I was excited because I knew she was. She hadn't got a good card. A normal card's crap, really, basically. And I know realistically she's not going to get an in form because um, I know that she recently she's had a baby. She has gone back into the, but she's not going to get a juice special card really, unless like EA yeah, decide to do a mad women's promo and stuff. Um, Hi to her. Realistically, let's be honest. I think a lot of us know her just for being Alfonso Davis's ex. It's true, though. It's true. Everyone knows of her because of Davies, which is fair enough. Alicia Lehman, let's be honest, everyone knows about her because she, her name is, like, more embossed into women's football now. More, she she's like the equivalent of, actually, David Beckham, where her name is bigger, not bigger than the sport, but she's known outside the sport of being, like, this fashion icon and, like, being her brand. Because uh, even like the Sky Sports um, advert for the Women's Super League, it's quite a lot tailored around like Lauren James and stuff, and like doing like running down. I think it's not a hallway, but like running and like um, the football. And then you, it cuts to Alicia Lamer. She's doing a signature on the floor. In it's a giant signature. And I think yes, that's endorsing her brand. But is that endorsing her as a player? Maybe she just wants to be that. She's to be fair, she's an average um, women's player, but that doesn't mean she's bad. She she's like women's super league standard, very good standard still, but she's not as good as other players. Um, but yeah, it's interesting. I didn't know about Benini. Obviously, I my knowledge was limited just to England basically and WSL teams, but I've learned so much about women's football. It's Is it a good thing that people learn about players through FIFA? No. Because everyone's ball knowledge is incredible because of FIFA. But people do judge players off FIFA. <coughs> Which is um, 
unfair. Because let's be honest, like people just look at it and say, oh, he ain't got much pace, he's useless. But have you seen him play in real life? No, of course not. Um, have I seen every player in my team play live? Maybe not Neville. When I say live, it's like even just watching on TV. I haven't seen Heitemar play. I haven't seen Kiernan play. I haven't seen Benini play. I haven't seen Neville play. I've seen Millie Bright. I've seen Williamson. I've seen Greenwood, Cuthbert, Toon, Stanway, McCabe, Kirby and Russo. Yeah. I wouldn't check... Like, if, if someone offered me an account tomorrow that had, I don't know, Mbappe up front... Uh, Rashford, like all these like the most expensive cards. Um, I'll choose this hundred percent, and that shows because I put Harland into an SBC to get Cuthbert. Because realistically, I've got Russo up front. Why would I need another striker? I'm not turned off. Um, all men's players, but. I'd prefer a women's um, equivalent now. So this game's about having fun. And I get most enjoyment and most fun from using the team like this now. I just wish that the EO would actually finally add career mode where you could actually be a women's team. I'd do a series on that. 100% I'd do it with Arsenal. I'd build a team. I'd probably bring uh, Ella Toon in from United. Uh, because well she's best friends with Alyssa <laughs> no, she's a fantastic player um, I'm just excited think of like the point where I'm at now and I've got all these special cards I could save up now and uh, just wait for another promo to come out wait for a better card to come out because I would love it if there was a I, 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 I don't know actually I don't know what promos but imagine like a uh, what, what would be a good promo to um, imagine Footmas came out just because of like we're coming up to a Christmas period Imagine a footmas. No, but like old school, like FIFA 19, where it was like the red cards with a bit of snow on the top. Um, like that, like Bobby Firmino one. There was like Van Anhol, um Loads of us. But I just remember that Bobby Firmino was something insane. Imagine a footmas. McCabe. 15 days till Christmas. It's like just at the back of her shit. Like Williamson's just down there. Where, like, she's pointed about it's number 15, 15 days till Christmas, and it's a Kate McCabe, or, or 23 days to Christmas, the less serious, so footmas, the less serious, so it'd be insane, it would, it would be insane. Um, but anyway, guys, I am gonna wrap up this episode. I've been ranting and just having fun with it for the last half hour since my last game. Obviously, we're building the team, which was a lot of fun just building the team, having a bit of laugh with it, and it's. I just don't understand how anyone could just use a full men's team in this game. Something just new and exciting. The best feature EA's ever ha added to Ultimate Team is women's. And I just I just don't understand it. They just feel crazy good in this game. It's nuts. I've taken out David Beckham, <laughs> whose card is nuts, for... Look, I'll show you. Probably five of the six stats are better on Beckham. Actually, it's a bit closer than I thought. Dribbling's the same. Defending's the se uh, better on uh, Cuthbert. She's slightly quicker. Her shooting is nearly the same. Passing isn't as good, but with a catalyst, it gets up to that level. This Cuthbert card is nearly as good as David Beckham. Crazy, isn't it? Oh, stat check. 700 and she's nearly 100 goals ahead. Wow. Um, she has contributed nearly 1,100 
<laughs> oh my god. That's crazy even just to say. Yeah, it's absolute nuts. But anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap this up. I'm going to get some food, and then I'm going on COD. I've just realised it's already 8 o'clock. But I am going to go and play COD. I will be live for that. So give me about a half hour. Maybe it'll be about half past 8. Um, it depends what I get to it. Really put. Um, but yeah, guys, until tomorrow's Alessia's Allure, if you're just here for that, um, then I will see you tomorrow. If you are going to stick around, then we are going to play some Call of Duty. Um, but yeah, until next time, guys. Goodbye!